Good day, pupils. How are you today? We'll start our English lesson. Please take your books and your copy books and go to page number 18. Today's our new theme is Fun Races. Salimit sizdir mi ballar? Ağlşın tili sabahın bastaymız. Bugün gajanga taqırıbımız Fun Races. Qızıqtı sayıstar. Please take your copy books and write down today's our new theme, new vocabularies. Listen and repeat. At a snail's pace. At a snail's pace. Lulardan jıldamdığım men. Uite bayao. Championship. Championship. Championat. Competition. Competition. Jaris. Sayis. Doda konkurs. Cross. Cross. Cries. Field. Field. Wurus. Hilarious. Hilarious. Kazakta. Kungulda. Local. Local. Jirgulikta. Outer. Outer. Sartka. Paddle. Paddle. Pedal. Pound. Pound. Toran. Reach. Reach. Jitu. Spray. Spray. Burku. Burkturu. Sibu. Stick. Stick. Ustalu. Ustal. A, sil a silver tankard. A silver tankard. Sarakapta masa. Track. Track. Ayin. Sokpak. Surlew. World record. World record. Alim de record. Please write down these new vocabularies with their translations. Please watch the video about fun races. Please watch the video about fun races. Fun races. When you hear the word race, what comes to mind? Maybe a swimming race, perhaps a car race. Well, some people think of snails and tin baths. When my sister asked me to go to a snail race with her, I thought it sounded a little too strange to be real. But a week later, I was in a field, sticking a number on a garden snail. We decided to call our snail Lewis, after Formula One's Lewis Hamilton. A farmer sprayed water on a table, and shouted, Ready, steady, slow! And the snails were off! Sort of. Lewis came third in 3 minutes 35 seconds. The world record is 2 minutes by a snail called Archie in 1995. Hopefully this year's winner enjoyed his prize. A silver cup full of lettuce. Last summer, my Uncle Tom took part in the Tin Bath Championships in Castletown Harbour on the Isle of Man. I really wanted to watch the race, so he agreed to take me. Uncle Tom found an old tin bath and made some paddles. Just before the race, we decorated his bath with flags and balloons and he dressed up as a Viking. The winner is the person who crosses the finish line first, or the person who gets the furthest before they sink. It's difficult to stay dry, and although Uncle Tom's bath sank, he still won. It was hilarious. Do you know any unusual races in your country? What are they like? Thank you for your watching this video. And let's do the tasks. And there is a text about the fun races. Please read this text carefully. Task 1. Exercise 2. In this exercise, you have to read this text again and to complete the sentences with the word or phrase from the text. Бірінші тапсырма, екінші жаттығу. Бұл жаттығуда текстті жақсылап тағы да оқиымыз. Және берілген сөйлемдерді текстің ішіндегі сөздермен немесе фразалармен толықтырып жазып шығыңыздар. Exercise 3 in this exercise, you have to match the words in bold in the texts to their meanings. 
үшінші жаттығу. Бұл жаттығуда берілген сөйлемдердің дефинициаларын сәкестендіріп шығыңыздар. And for your home task, exercise 4. In this exercise, you have to make sentences using the prompts in the relative pronoun in brackets as in the example. For example, Kanaham is where the World Snail Racing Championships take place. Write down please correctly. Ижымысы 4-ші жаттығу. Бұл жаттығу да мысалға қарап отырып, берілген жақшаның ішіндегі есімдіктерді қолдана отырып сөйлемді толықтырыңыздар. You may write with answers. Good luck to everyone.